Hello, Namaste, Salam Walekum, Sastriyakal. Welcome back to another session with your Vashef at Vareva.com. Today we are going to learn how to make Chota Piaska Salam. I am telling you, this is so super that once in a while I definitely want to make this. When you are making this kind of salam using small onions, you want the gravy to be little extra sour than the other salams. So dear friends, for this, you know, I'm going to take one tablespoon of uh, peanuts and we're going to slowly dry roast these peanuts. One tablespoon of sesame seeds. After slow cooking the peanuts and uh, sesame seeds, equal quantity, all one, one tablespoon of, uh, you know, uh, peanut, coconut and sesame seeds. And even this, we're going to slightly roast this and then we're going to put this in a blender and make this into a nice fine paste. Once the oil is hot, add some mustard seeds when the mustard seeds crackle add red chilies cumin seeds and little bit of uh, methi dana methi dana is a fenugreek seeds but do not add too much it will give bitterness in this we are going to add onions just sliced onions pinch of salt in this add a curry leaf now look at this the onions are nice and golden in this add some ginger garlic paste once the ginger garlic paste raw flavor is gone in this Add a pinch of uh, turmeric, that should be good. Add a chili powder, you know, little extra chili powder for this. Cumin powder, add coriander powder, some green chili, peanut and uh, sesame seed and coconut paste. Pour all of this mixture on top of this and mix it. You know, add water till this becomes like a very thin curry. You know, now you have to cook this for at least 30 minutes on a slow flame. After cooking around almost 30 minutes, look at this, the oil has separated from this uh, peanut sesame seed and coconut uh, gravy. Now look at this, the gravy is nice and thick and uh, now the oil is slightly floating in this. Add some mint and some chopped coriander and this will really really enhance your salon gravies. In this, we are going to add uh, uh, tamarind juice because you know, we're going to use uh, tamarind to make this uh, salon. We're going to add uh, some tamarind juice. You're going to make this extra sour by adding little extra tamarind. And also adjust the seasoning by adding some salt. And also, we're going to add a little bit of sweetness. You can add a pinch of sugar or jaggery. But first, I'm going to cook these uh, shallots in this uh, salon gravy for around 15 minutes on a slow flame. Till this... Uh, onion become nice and soft. You know, while these uh, shallots are um, getting cooked, you can also add some jaggery or sugar. But traditionally, jaggery gives a better taste with this tamarind kind of uh, gravies. And just uh, let this uh, cook and the jaggery will melt in no time. Wow. And you want to cook this till your onions are soft. They will become juicy and little transparent. Now, after 15 minutes of slow cooking, simmering, you will see some of this onion skin will be, you know, coming off the onion. That means the inside is also nicely cooked. That's when you switch off the flame. This is a fantastic salon of uh, small onions. I'm telling you, the little bit of extra of sourness and little bit of sweetness makes this fantastic. Make it in the night and have this onion ka salon early in the morning with chapatis. Wow, wow, wow. But, you know, you can have this anytime. Look at this, onion ka salon with my favorite chapati. Hmm. I hope you enjoyed today's session of learning how to make this baby onion salon. But do not forget, Vareva is all about inspiring others to cook. So please post your recipes and cooking tips at vareva.com so others can benefit from your great cooking. Thank you. Hmm. Wow.